Hello and greetings, everybody, and good evening. It is now good morning. Two twenty a.m. in the morning. It's two twenty a.m. in the morning. Mm -hmm. And welcome to our channel. I am His Majesty, and right over there is Joseph. And unbelievably, we're up at two a.m. in the morning, reading some of these comments that we get from our youtube channel first of all i'd like to thank each and every individual person that has subscribed to our channel we really appreciate you subscribing to our channel we really appreciate all the positive feedback that we have been getting believe me when i say this we are very very humbled by some of the messages that you guys send us um Especially the people that <clears throat> really get us. And what I mean when I say that is, is that we want you to see the love that we have amongst one another. We want you to see the bond that we have amongst one, one another and the unity and the loyalty and all those great things. With that being said, I really need, feel the need to address this. And I'm going to address this once and one time only, and I'm not going to address it anymore. Let me just say this, Joseph and I never have and are not a part of the Usher board. We have no affiliation with the Usher board. For those of you that think that we do, you're absolutely wrong, you're absolutely mistaken. We are not part of the Usher board, we don't even know who the Usher board is. Like, I, I, do you know who they are? No. I don't know who the Usher board is. Uh, we're not even monetized. We're not even monetized. I've watched, I've watched videos from the Usher board from time to time. Um, but believe it or not, um, the only videos that I used to watch on Andrew Caldwell were on Facebook. And I very seldom watch videos on Andrew Caldwell. Um, how the first video came about was just one day I just so happened to be watching him and decided to express the way I felt about him. That was <coughs> back in June of 2018. Um, if you look at the video, you'll see that that video was, was created back in 2018. I don't know. I don't understand why now it has gotten all the views that it has gotten. Yes, we we have made three other videos after that, but the only reason why we made those videos is because we made them in response to what was sent to us. Andrew sent messages to us, threatening us. And so that is the only reason why we made the other three videos. Understand this, it is not our motive to build our channel off of the videos that we made on Andrew Caldwell. That just happens to be so. Um, yes, I have to agree. And I can't deny the fact that the Andrew Caldwell videos are the most rated videos the the most viewed of of our videos but if you have joined our channel just let me know when it's my turn i will but if you have joined our channel because you think that we are going to be a channel that sets out to go after andrew caldwell then you should unsubscribe now because that is not our motive that is not our platform as I stated before, the only reason why I made the first video on Andrew Caldwell was because one day I just so happened to be watching him and I felt the need to express the way I felt about him and that's it. With all due respect, I have absolutely no problem with Andrew Caldwell. I've said what I've said about him. I stand behind that. I think that he should live in his truth. I think that he should stop lying. I think that he should stop the buffoonery um, and that's it. No judgment, no hate. I don't hate, I can't hate someone that I don't know. And I do not know Andrew Caldwell. 
So um, for those of you that are in the comments that are saying that um, we got the most views off of Andrew Caldwell's videos, you said that to say what? We know we know that. Is it my turn? Not yet. We know that we got the most views um, off of his videos. So, I mean, is that a capital crime? Um, is, um, I, I don't understand. I don't, this is what I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand that some people think that we came up with this sinister plan to say, okay, we're going to make these videos of Andrew Car for, uh, um, you know, um, about Andrew Caldwell and we'll, it, we're going to go viral. It's not that deep y'all. Andrew Caldwell, although he does have a blue check mark on Instagram and he is a, what he considers a public figure. Um, and he is a public figure in social media. It's not that deep. He's not Michael Jackson. He's not Kim Kardashian. He ain't Mary J. Blige. He ain't Beyonce. So, you know, um, you guys are acting like he is just this big, big, big celebrity that you see on TV every week. Um, and for all you women that are telling us, leave him alone and you're defending all these things that he's saying. If you love Andrew so much, then I challenge you. Give him a call because he's looking for a woman. Give him a call and and um, let him take you out on a date. Let him show you a good time. You love him so much. Um, I don't understand. You guys think that we're picking on him. Um, and you act as if we're the only ones that are doing this. I mean, I'm not using that as an excuse, but I've watched his videos on Facebook. And the only thing that I see are people just being totally disrespectful to him. When I watch him on Facebook, whenever I watch him, I don't leave comments at all. I don't leave comments on him. I, I have left some comments on him when he's threatened me. I tell him, to, I told him to stop threatening me and my husband and that's it. But I don't call him sis, cookie or, to, or, or, or tootie or whatever. I don't care. I, I'm comfortable in my skin. I've been through all of that. I've been called sis. I've been called tootie. I've been called worse names than that. It doesn't matter to me what people think about me. He's the one that it matters to, not me. I don't need anybody's validation or um, approval to be who I am. I am Tremel, Tremel McRae, his majesty. And there's nothing that anybody can do to change that. So with that being said, the only thing I'm, the only reason why I'm making this video is because I know that it's not going to stop, but I thought I'd just give it a try. Um, I really wish you people that are in the comments that are telling us to leave him alone and you have your opinions about us, our motives. Um, I really wish you guys would really stop it. Is it my turn? I really wish you guys would stop it. You really need to stop it. It really doesn't make any sense and it really makes no difference to us at all. Is it my turn? Yes, yeah, your turn. Fuck all you bitches, okay? First of all, if you bitches didn't like mess to begin with, the videos wouldn't be the most watched videos on our YouTube page if you didn't like mess. And if you go back to June, to the very first video we made, only had 126 likes. Now, if people went back and watched it more, then I don't know what to tell you, but that video only had 126 views. The only reason why these videos have so many views is because you bitches don't like him. And you bitches want to see him be red. And the only people... I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to say what I wanted to say. But all you bitches, because there's always women that feel sorry for him. Do you bitches tell him to leave people alone? Did you have a problem where he sat there and called Lonnie Love Big Ham in that video he just made the other day? Did you tell him that wasn't right to be fat shaming her? Did you go on his page and tell him that? No, because you bitches always want to play like he got a mental problem. Well, guess what, bitches? I got a mental problem, too. I fuck you and fuck what you think.
Period. End the story. This is what my motherfucking him? channel, and we will do what the fuck we want to do and say what the fuck we want to say. And guess what you can do if you don't like it? And white people smell like dogs. That's what he said in the Lonnie Love video. Yeah. Now, believe me, if we wanted to bash Andrew, he gives us content every single day. That he every single time he goes live, we can make a video. If that's what we were setting out to do, if if that was the case, then. That's what would happen like what the Usher boy did. Every time he made a video, they took the video and made a video. But that's not our main purpose. I don't understand why all you women that sit and protect him and come up in our little inboxes, why don't you go give him some pussy? He looking to get, he, he want to have some sex with somebody. So go give him some pussy since you love him so much. Since you so, you know, pro-Andrew bitch. And he's delivered. Go get, matter of fact, go date him. That's what I want to see. I want to see the one first of them thing. Do. Oh, you know he's mental. So you bitches just run around. Everybody, but that's the problem with you black people. That y'all know a bitch got a mental problem, and y'all want to sit and pacify their motherfucking ass and send them to church and make them believe that God is fixing shit when God ain't doing nothing for them but sitting there looking at they, laughing at their ass, and he makes a fool of his motherfucking self every day. But this ain't about him. So I'm not going to even sit here and talk about, but, about but, you. But wait a minute. Mental. Wait a minute. Let's talk about the mental issue. He got mental issues. Okay. Um, since y'all since sit here and y'all want to talk about how he has mental issues. If you took the time. If y'all took the time to, to really look at my page. To look at our page. You would go back. Go back and look at my, our, my video on mental health. Because I do have bipolar disorder and I've made a video about that, but I don't make excuses for my behavior. No, it's fine for him. To I don't say make excuses do, for my behavior because I have bipolar disorder. But then when a person attack him or they feel he's being attacked, they want to sit up like somebody fucking mother and tell motherfuckers what to say and do. But fuck all you bitches. And that's the way I feel. H and most of you bitches don't have a picture. You got just a letter next to your motherfucking name or a motherfucking smiley face. So I can't read you for dog filth like I want to. Right. But what I'm not going to do is waste my time on you bitches. That's why I block you. Because I don't have time. The other people, they get it. Most of them say the same thing we do. Because most of the, every video we've made has all been on stuff that he said out of his mouth. And stuff that he has done. Yeah. It's never been us just making a video bashing him. But because we're not sitting there going along with his book. Matter of fact... Why don't y'all all go on his live and send that motherfucker super chats? And I ain't talk about the bullshit super chats y'all gave him. A dollar ninety nine and ninety nine cents. Yeah. Since y'all so pro Andrew, why don't you bitches sit there and give him ten dollars and more? Right. Since y'all so pro Andrew, see I'ma help the motherfucker out. Yeah. Since you so pro Andrew, all you bitches that got comments to make on my motherfucking page, why don't you go on his live and send that motherfucker some super chats? I ain't talking about ninety nine cent. I ain't talking about a dollar ninety nine. I'm talking about ten dollars and more. You can thank me later, Andrew. Send him ten dollars or more since y'all so fucking pro Andrew. Yeah. We don't ask we have not asked anybody I for ain't a asked dime. Nobody for shit. We can't even give a motherfucking super chat. Because, see, that's the problem. Y'all so worried about what y'all think we getting from the video. And we ain't getting shit. Nothing. Not a dime. Nothing. We don't get, we, we're not even monetized. Even when we go live. When we went live, somebody was like, I'm surprised y'all could go live. Because they know how YouTube work. Yeah, we're not even monetized. We put our cash app up and don't nobody, one person, one person. We got one person that sent us a contribution to our <coughs> platform. That's it. <coughs> and we're grateful for that. We're, we're grateful for that. And if nobody ever sends us another if, dime, we'll still be grateful. And if I was really pressed, I would sit here and call all you motherfuckers screen names. And say what I want to say to y'all individually, but I don't have time for that. Because in reality, if you bitches was in my face, you wouldn't say half the shit you did. And that's real. Because I ain't Andrew. I don't give a fuck. Period. But it's okay. It's okay for Andrew to do all that bullshit. But the minute somebody else do it, y'all got a problem with it. We bullying him. Bullying who? I didn't go on his page and threaten him. He came on my page and threatened me.
I never said I was going to do nothing to him. I said, if he even think that he going to do something to me, then we got a situation and I'm going to fear my situation. I mean, we getting, we getting death notices from him. He told it. He sent us. A, we got receipts. I have receipts. We got receipts where he says he's going to send us a death notice on the 15th. No, this on the twelfth of March. Yeah, on the twelfth of March, we're gonna we somebody supposed to we supposed to somebody supposed to kill us, uh, and that was from Andrew Caldwell. We know it was from Andrew Caldwell. I have the receipts. But you where he's, he's about told us said. his security team has has gotten in contact with us. His quote unquote security team that he has has gotten in touch with us and told us that we better stop making videos on him or else we're gonna be sorry. But that's okay. See, this video ain't about him. This video is about you bitches that yeah. believe him and follow him because that means you're just as mentally unstable as he is. So a video need to be made about your ass. No, I really think that they, they send us these messages to get a rise out of us. They want to really, they really want us, they really want to get a rise out of us. But it's not going to happen. because I don't respond what, to the what, comments. Are, what, what do you want? Do, are you, do you want us to make another video about him? Or maybe that's the tactic behind it. The more they say, the more videos we'll make about him. But that's not the purpose of the video. The platform. Listen, guys. Our pla This is our platform. My name is Tramel McRae. And that's my husband, Joseph. We are a gay, black, married couple. Something that is very rare to see in social media. There are not a lot of black gay couples that share their world with you. And that's the only thing that we're doing. We only we just want to share just a little part of our world with you. If you watch any of our other videos, we don't talk about Andrew Caldwell. We talk about life. We talk about the things that we have endured in life. Some of the things that we have ex experienced. We share with you some of our experiences. That's what we want to do. This is we our platform is not to be the the next usher board. Not at all. To be honest with you, we don't even go to church. So, you know, I you know, I, I really um as much as I appreciate as much as we appreciate all of the subscribers that have subscribed to us, I'm hoping that they I'm hoping that all the people that have subscribed to us have not done so because they think that we are here to bash Andrew Caldwell. I've said it before and I, I will say it again. And I, I'm, I'm saying this directly to you, Andrew Caldwell. If you, you should ever see this video, I don't know you. I don't know you. Um, you could be the nicest person in the world as far as I know. I don't know you. Um, but I don't like what I see of you. And that's it. Um, and I have every right to feel that way because you, that's what you're putting out. Understand this, people. In this world, you get what you give. If you give goodness, you're going to get goodness back. If you give negative, you're going to get negative back. If you give a whole bunch of bullshit, that's what you're going to get back. If you give a whole bunch of lies, somebody's going to call you on your lies. I'm done with this subject. I'm not addressing it anymore. So anybody from this point on that sends a message about Andrew Caldwell and how they feel about us making videos about Andrew Caldwell, know this. Your comments are going to go unheard because when I see them, I'm going to delete them because I have that choice. And also with that being said, if you do not like our channel and you do not like the four videos that we made on Andrew Caldwell, you have a choice too. You can pass us by. There are so many other great content creators on YouTube. There's T.S. Madison. There's King Jives. There's Armand Wiggins. There is um, um, Sean Bradley. There is Wiley. There is so There are so many. There's Lovely T. There's Daytime Tea Time. There's so many. B loves life. There's lips. There's so many other great content creators here on YouTube that you can take the opportunity to watch besides the McCray Kings. 
If you want to, if you want to be a part of the McCray Kings, if you want to sit at the round table with the McCray Kings, then you're more than happy to join us. Like, subscribe, and comment. With that being said, I'm signing off. I don't have nothing else to say. Do you have anything else to no, say? No, I'm done. I ain't want to say this. Make sure you walk in love, peace, and happiness. And always remember, always remember that it's Team McCray. All damn day. Have a good night. Peace. Greetings, everyone. I am His Majesty Tremel McCray, and I have bipolar disorder. If you know someone that is dealing with a mental issue, or if you yourself feel as though you're dealing with a mental issue, go seek out someone in your local community that may be able to help you. It perhaps may be a minister, a community center, or a community health center, but go seek out help. As I tell everyone, I, see, I, I take my medication and I also see my therapist and she gives me the tools to deal with me. And because of that, I am living my best life. I thank and appreciate you guys for listening to me. And please watch my video on my mental health. With that being said, I'm out of here. Walk in love, peace and happiness. And remember, it's Team McCray all damn day. Talk to you soon.